She okay? Oh yeah, we vetted her. She had a really nice segment on her measles vaccine Niger last year. And you told her not to call it Mad Med Flesh? Check. And we told her Simpro's introduction into the food supply is blameless. Simpro is safe. It's clean. Normal, safe, inevitable. Yeah, but just don't say inevitable, because that sounds scary. I don't want to sound scary. Integral climate crisis, because that's political. Don't want to be political about the end of the world. I got you. How about we found a way to feed all of humanity, right? Dr. Christie, tell us about your meat. Jesus, stand down. Fuck. They're just doing their jobs. That's what they do. Ooh, there's my old buddy Tony Chandler from the FDA. This is going to be bad. What? Why? Never had kind words for Tony. Not once. I called her a bureaucratic, timid little bitch weasel. All right, we play this aggressive. Yes. No. Tony, this is a mistake. I agree. You gonna help me fix it? Yeah, I'd like to see your paperwork for this government overreach. Thomas, I am happy to have you tested for the flu. I want you to test it. Yeah, he just doesn't want to be treated like a criminal. Stop. Kevin, you're not being treated like a criminal. You're being treated like a regular person. I know that's jarring for the great doctor. Stop the assembly, please. Wait, 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 wait. Tony, all we're asking is that you allow us to continue production while you test. I mean, we're shipping it to 23 different high schools. Yeah, this government we're, overreach we're, we're is benching 100 a, employees, a teams struggling sample. schools. You haven't proven there's anything wrong with it. Thomas. Let's stop killing kids, maybe, while we figure it out. Shut it down. Gentlemen and lady, we have some serious issues. Who's the boy? He's the boy with Utopia. This one is a bit of a broken record. Where's Jessica Hyde? This is like a little turdy pop song that's stuck in my head. I wake up in the middle of the night, take a piss, and there it is. I'm shaving and showering in the morning, there it is. I'm having relations of an intimate variety with the lady friend. And there it goes. Where's Jessica Hyde? I need this earworm out of my head. And she's not alone. She's got some comic book nerds with her. Between them, they've seen several pages of Utopia, which is several more than we've seen, which is unacceptable. We need to find a way to make them reveal themselves. And this one, this is our most immediate concern. Our gentle, spineless scientist has somehow found his backbone and is in St. Louis, demanding that he personally conduct the field test for his vaccine. Oh my gosh. Oh, Thomas, we can't have Michael there, man. He could blow this whole thing up. Yeah. If he gets a blood sample, we have real problems. He was supposed problems. to study the sample of flu we sent him, conclude it was his flu, and then sound the victory all Yes, for us. obviously, Kara. He was supposed to do what we had every reason in the world to believe that he would do, but he didn't. I know what to do. We need to pull a duet source from home. We need to start manufacturing the vaccine now. Everything has to happen now. So... What next? We need Utopia. We need to find the boy. So how do we get him? We're gonna crowdsource the shit out of him. Need to make sure that everyone in America is looking for that little shit. I suggest a honey, not vinegar. So, let's brainstorm. Amber Alert. We don't know the kid's name. But do we have a similar at home? Likely. Then we stage a kidnapping. Mom comes forward. Then we have his identity and concerned citizens out there looking for him. Kidnapping. It's very local news. I was thinking public park. Spree killing. That sounds extreme. Yeah, this is an extreme situation. I'm, I'm sorry. Killing innocent children. Innocent children are already dying by the dozens from our flu. That was an understood sacrifice, Thomas. Yes, Kara. Those children were the understood sacrifice. What have you done today to, to earn your place in this crowded world? Need you to think bigger picture here. So, Winger Park. <laughs> My children play in Winger Park. Dayton Grove Park is also a very accessible park. There are no blockades. I'm sorry, Thomas, I have to object.
none of the rest of you have a problem with this? You can't object to the unnecessary murdering of innocent families in a park. Kara, we understand you're a mother. This has, this has nothing to do with me being a mother, Thomas. Or a woman, or not tough enough. I was one of the first people on board. This isn't about me being weak or sentimental or... There is a line. Kara, are you having doubts about our larger purpose? No, I'm not, Thomas. Then can we continue? Sure. Does your dad know about this, Thomas? Lean in, Kara. You're an asshole, Thomas. You're getting emotional. I see. Calm I'm down, not, okay? I'm not being emotional. Okay. You're a fount of reason. 